Well, when you become an entrepreneur, um, you learn to defy gravity and uh, fight the odds. You also begin to believe you're indestructible, especially when you're successful. So I achieved a lot of success. I mean, I built one company, I helped take it public, and then I built another company which, which was doing spectacularly well. We were on top of the world. And I began to believe that I was indestructible. I was like my company that we were going to take over. And it was working day in and day, in, uh, day and night. And, and the company got into trouble. I, I doubled my workload and um, gave it all I had. Except I realized the hard way that I was destructible. That um, um, my body had limits and ended up having a massive heart attack. That was a life-changing event for me. As it turned out, um, I decided to become an academic after that, not go back to the tech world. Because I was tired of... Uh, the rough and tough world of uh, technology where it was all about making money. I wanted to now start giving back to the world. But the fact is, the lesson was that you have to keep monitoring your own health. You have to realize that there are limits to what your body can do. That your mind may want to um, you know, achieve a lot and change the world, but your body has its limits. So you have to keep getting checkups. You have to maintain a, a work-life balance. You have to meditate. You have to give back to people. And don't obsess over making money, obsess over doing good for the world.